Hi guys and welcome back here to Drone Emotion. Today we're back here once again guys with a brand new video with some breaking news for all of you. And we have some very very exciting news and probably one of the most exciting ones we've had here in the past few months. And that is because the long awaited Hotel Evo Mini is official. It has been confirmed 100%. The first images have been leaked. In fact, we have two different images that have leaked, which include the whole body of the drone. In addition to that, we're going to be talking about the controller because we also have a picture of the controller. And of course, we're going to be talking and discussing the specs that this new drone is going to be having, flight time, resolution, and most importantly, the release date. Today's video is going to be packed with some very exciting information regarding this new brand new auto drone that has just been leaked out of nowhere so without any much further ado let's go ahead and get it started but before we do so if you're new to the channel welcome here and don't forget to hit that subscribe button because in this channel we'll always be the first ones to bring you the most recent drone news no matter what and also if you want to keep with any updates such as the mini 3 the Evo Mini or the Mavic 3 guys, keep in mind that you know this is the place to come for all of those updates and also we're currently in the road to 10,000 subscribers and right now we're less than 3,000 subscribers away. So if you're watching today's video and you're not subscribed to the channel yet, well I invite you to go ahead and join the Drone Emotion family so that you can help us get to that goal which we're really not that far away from anymore. So with that being said, why don't we just go ahead and get it started with today's video because I am very excited to talk about today's topic and that is because for about a while now, more particularly about six months ago when Otto had their event in CS 2021 and we talked about the possibilities of Otto releasing a mini drone and we said to you that we knew that Otto was developing something, we knew that they were going to be coming out with a sub 250 gram drone but unfortunately it did not happen back in January of 2021 but what happened six months later my friends well the Autel Evo Mini has been leaked and it's basically official it is right on the corner and thanks to WeChat which is a Chinese social media this is where these images have been leaked in addition to that we have our good, our good friend Jasper Allen which was able to provide us with some extra nice information so Without any much further ado, why don't we just go ahead and take a look at this Hotel Evo Mini which is going to be weighing under 250 grams and it's going to be direct competition towards the Mini 2 from DJI and the Hobson Sino Mini Pro and also the Sino Mini SC. Guys, this Mini drone market is getting more and more competition day by day so let's go ahead and take a look at the first images of the Autel Evo Mini right here on screen guys there we have our first image what do you think at a first glance this looks really good the first thing that comes to our eye is the fact that we have four different models or versions so that is quite interesting now the first thing that we see is that classic orange colorway on on the drone now that is a classic Autel color which is the same one that we had on the original Autel Evo 2 Pro and Evo 2 which I'm a big fan of I actually like the orange now we also are going to be able to have it on a white version or if you're not happy with that white well you can also get it on that gray color scheme or that like really dark orange which is kind of similar to a red so I really like the color choice I think the red is a bit repetitive, I would have liked to see a little, a little bit something different but I, I'm, I'm not complaining, this looks phenomenal. So that's our first image. Now on top we can clearly see our controller which is definitely completely different to what we've seen with previous Autel or DJI drones. I mean what we have right here is something different. This is more kind of like a gaming kind of controller kind of like what you find with an Xbox or with a PlayStation. This is also kind of similar to what we have with Parrot and Skydio drones. So if you're familiar with those drones, well, this is going to be very familiar to you. You're going to be having no issues, but I definitely like the design. I think something a bit more compact will have been better, but 
it's not bad. I mean, there we can see our our sticks and how we're gonna be placing our phone in the top. I'm not a big fan of this type of controllers. I prefer the kind of normal DJI style controllers or or the one that we have on the Auto Libo 2. I think I'm a big fan of that as well. I'm not really a big fan of this one, but I mean, let me know what you guys think. Are you a big fan of this kind of style controller or are you more of a more traditional kind of guy? Let me know what you guys think. So that is the first image that we have. Now let's go ahead and take a look at our second image that we have right here on the screen, guys. There we have that second image. So without a doubt, it looks really good. Now this is a different shot of the drum, this, was, this is a picture from behind. Now this image is definitely a bit more revealing than the previous one and well that is because here is where we're going to be able to see the first specs that this new Autel Evo Mini is going to be having. Now what do we see right there? Well we see that the battery is going to be inserted from the back just like what Autel has done with the Evo. 2 Pro and Evo 2, which is something I, I quite like. So battery is going to be inserted from the back and something really good is the fact that we see rear obstacle avoidance. That is great news and also we don't only have sensors in the back, we also have obstacle avoidance in the front and underneath. So basically we're going to be having a three-way obstacle avoidance with this new Autel Evo Mini, which guys this is what we what we wanted with the Mini 2, but DJI did not deliver this to us. So I think DJI might be a little worried now because with the release of the Sino Mini Pro, the Sino Mini SE, the Xiaomi Fimi X8 Mini, and now the Auto Libo Mini. I mean, DJI, you better step up your game, guys. Better start thinking about what you're gonna do because that Mini 2 is starting to look a bit updated. I'm just saying, but. This looks really promising. So three-way ops collaboration is something that we know for sure. Now, the way that the props are mounted, it looks like they're also going to be a screw in props, like what we have with the Mini 2 and with the Sino Mini Pro. They will not be quick release. Now, let's talk about camera specs. What do we know so far? Unfortunately, we don't have any specs regarding the flight time or the resolution, but I think we can expect to have at least 4K resolution in this drone. I would expect to see 4K 30 and 4K 60, that will just be amazing. But I think that's definitely what we're, to, what we're going to be having with this new Autel Evo Mini. What about the image resolution? Well, I'm expecting for this new Autel Evo Mini to have 48 megapixel images. Now, flight time, we don't have it confirmed, but definitely do expect at least 30 minutes, if not, because we know that Autel are the kings of flight time when they first released the Autel Evo 2 over two years ago and they released that drone with a 40 minute flight time so I'm guessing my guess for this new Evo Mini will be 40 minutes of flight time now what will the name be will this be called the Evo Mini the Mini Evo what will the name be well we have received confirmation thanks to our good friend Jasper Allen that the name of this sub 250 gram drone from Autel will be the Autel Nano. So that's going to be the name that this drone is going to have. So definitely a quite interesting name and different from that mini kind of name that we have come to know here in the past year since the original Mavic Mini. Now we also do know thanks for good friend Osita LB that there are going to be two in each series of this Evo there are going to be two options and four different colors so stay tuned for that because we're gonna be having a video coming out really soon because it looks like there might be a Mavic Air 2 competitor from Autel coming soon so stay tuned for that but we're gonna be having four different color choices that we have already discussed and let's go ahead and talk about pricing and release date well at this moment in time unfortunately we do not have an exact pricing but we can expect it to range between 400 and I would say 600 at max so I think that's where we're going to be where the where the price is going to be at I definitely do not expect this new Evo Na Auto Nano to surpass the $600 mark I think it needs to stay below that in order for it to be competitive and compete and be direct competition for the Sino Mini Pro and the Mini 3 so what will the weight be well the weight will be 
under 250 grams so that's great news we know that with all of the regulations all around the world they're getting stricter by the day and mini drones have been the way to go here in the past two years we've seen a lot of mini releases particularly this year and now with this Autel Nano I'm pretty excited so that is the latest leaks that we have on the Autel Nano guys I am really pumped and very excited to see this new release from Autel when will we see it unfortunately we don't have an official released release it yet but rumors have it that it could be released as soon as next month nothing confirmed but I will personally expect this drone to be launched close to the holiday so probably around November December is when I am expecting this new Autel Nano to be released, but it could happen sooner. Guys, as soon as we have any more information, specs, flight time, pricing, official release date, don't worry, you will have all of those updates here first. That is everything that I have for today. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section down below. Are you happy that Autel has finally decided to come up with this Evo Mini or Autel Nano as they're gonna be calling it? Let me know what you guys think. Now, for everyone out there wondering, are these images real? Guys, there's no doubt about that. We know that Auto has done this in purpose in order to bring awareness to this brand new product. There's no doubt they're fake. This is 100% legit. So stay tuned and we wish, as we should be having a whole more info coming in the next few days. This is all that I have for today. Thanks so much for watching and see you tomorrow with a brand new video. Drone Emotion, signing out.